Hola señores, this is Final Fantasy Fan coming to you guys with a special, special video. If you've seen my previous video, you know I've gotten two Nintendo tapes, both on VHS. So now I'm going to play one of these. I watched both of them, and one of them is really cool. It's an advertisement for Star Fox 64, and this one I believe was a TV commercial. No, I'm not going to spoil it. It is really cool. I believe it's more than 10 minutes, so I'm going to split this up into different parts. Let's check out the Star Fox 64 VHS tape. Enjoy! I, re I reround it so you don't have to worry. Let's hit play. Enjoy! I'll be watching it from the back. And now, your feature presentation from Nintendo Power. landed. I repeat, the eagle has landed. Come on in. He's from Sony. Hey, buddy. You got the time. I'm sure, it's, uh... Hey, aren't you... Uh, He's from... And the orange guy is from Sega. The other orange guy is from Nintendo. <laughs> <laughs> What's this about? Quiet, big boy. We'll ask the questions around here. Do you uh, have to talk into that thing? Word on the street is you got a new Nintendo 64 game coming out. Could you be a little more specific? We got a lot of new games coming out. <laughs> Star Fox 64. Oh. Test pilot boy. You want to know about Star Fox 64, eh? Uh, yeah, and you'd better tell us all you know. Or else. Or else what? Or else, Plumber Boy here gets. It. Oh no, not Mario! <laughs> what are you guys doing with him? <laughs> no! No, don't hurt him! Mario, out of this! <laughs> Evil! Start talking! Okay, okay. You made your point. Star Fox 64 is the highly advanced combat game for the Nintendo 64. Awesome! The team includes Fox McCloud and his wingmen. Peppy Hare, Slippy Toad, and Falco Lombardi. The team is sent on missions to destroy Andros, the mad scientist who declared war on the entire Lilat system. This sounds like a fun bunch, but... What do these guys drive? <laughs> yeah, some beat up B-52. <laughs> <laughs> you wish. In Star Fox 64, there are three vehicles for missions. For air battles, you've got the R-Wing. Check this out. This vehicle comes with all the latest cool moves. You can do barrel rolls, make U-turns. It can even do somersaults. Do barrel rolls. And you can lock onto your enemies before blowing them away. And for battles on land, you've got the Landmaster tank. A totally brand new vehicle that hovers and rolls over enemy obstacles. Then, for water-based fighting, you've got this submarine called the Blue Marine. This baby fires torpedoes that light up the dark areas for better vision before taking out the enemy in front of you. Here they come! Listen to the real-time dialogue. Don't we all hate Slippy? Kinda makes you feel like you're part of the game, doesn't it? Wow. This really is the coolest game out there. So see? I told you. <laughs> you guys, you don't know the half of it. What? There's more? Oh, yeah. But Bob would kill me if I told you. Ooh, what is it? Just have to get this... Bob guy to tell us himself. Pizza for Bob. Are you, uh, Bob? Yeah, but, uh, I didn't order any pizza. Oh no, evil Sony, evil <laughs> Sega. Mmm, <laughs> look at good pizza, Peter. Glad you could join us, <laughs> Bob. 
that your test fighter pilot just spilled his guts about Star Fox 64. Peter! You didn't tell him about the rumble pack, did you? No. Bob. What is this rumble pack? You just did. I did. Pretty long for a commercial. Yeah. Spill it, big boy. Make me. With pleasure. Look at your little plumber boy now. What are you doing? No, not Mario. Not the Mario doll just in the battery table Oh no, not Mario. That's enough. That's enough. All right. Oh, Mario. Oh, this is the rumble pack. <gasps> oh my god. The big reason why Star Fox 64 is the coolest cinematic gaming experience there is. It's designed with a force feedback device that lets players feel the game. Wait a second. You're telling me that this rumble pack actually lets players feel the game? But like you're actually in the cockpit, flying and fighting? It's impossible. Nuh-uh. Yeah. Hook it up. I want to feel this myself. Oh, they're in for it now. The rumble pack lets you feel different degrees of vibration. Like when you turbo boost or you shoot a bomb, the rumble pack feeds back a slight turbulent vibration. Oh! I actually felt it. Told you so. And when you get hit by enemy fire, you feel even more of a vibration. <laughs> cool. What's even cooler is when you crash your vehicle, that's when you really feel the vibration. This is incredible. Well, what do you say, guys? You into a little multiplayer action? Ooh. Let's get ready to rock. Gentlemen, welcome to... Now, let me pause this right here. There was two Nintendo guys, a Sony guy, and a Sega guy. Probably back in 1999, all playing multiplayer on Nintendo 64. I've never thought I'd see this, see this day come. Well, hey, this is in the past. Can't we all just get along? I wish it was like this today. We're all the we're Nintendo, Sony, and Microsoft. We're all all guys. We're playing Wii together. Yeah, I want to see that. Up to four players at once. See that? Each player has his own quadrant on the screen, and there are three game modes. This is fantastic! <laughs> now, can you play this on Sega Saturn? No! Nope! Only on Nintendo 64! <laughs> well, what about PlayStation? Can you play this game on that system? Nope. No! Only on Nintendo 64! <laughs> oh, Nintendo you know, for the win! Star Fox 64 is just one of the cool games we got coming out! What? Oh, golden eye! Check that out. In-game trailers. Now keep in mind, these are beta fi footage. So you're going to see some beta fo footage of this. Hmm. That's Yoshi's story. Let's fast forward a little bit because I want to get this over with in the next 10 minutes. Wait, we passed a good one. Look at that. The Zelda 64 beta. That's what I'm talking about. Boy. Are we in big trouble? We just can't beat you guys. <laughs> yeah? Well, as much as we'd love to stick around here and keep playing with you guys, we gotta go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> oh, uh, by the way, have you seen this? Yeah, and there's much more to it, but we have to stop now. Peace.